Any plans on trying Odin language? No, it's kind of a useless language because we have C3. Like, I really don't understand why we as a humanity need Odin when we already have C3 and it covers pretty much all of the cases of Odin. It's just like Odin has no reason to exist. We have C3. It's just like, you, you can just forget this language. Like, you don't need Odin, honestly. Uh, as well as you don't need Zig. Right, C3 just covers all of the cases of both of these languages, like, you don't need them. There is no even reason to try Odin at this point, honestly. Like, I know that it's not gonna be better than C3. It's just, like, not gonna be better. <laughs> ah! <laughs> After C3, would you be willing to try Odin? No. Uh, the next stream is gonna be uh, programming in C3 to annoy Odin fans. Right, so today we're annoying specifically Zig fans. The next stream we're gonna be annoying specifically Odin fans. Right. Did we know Rust fans already? Yeah, I think I think we did. <laughs> I think we did. Uh, when is the stream to annoy C3 fans? When C3 uh, becomes more popular. As soon as it, be it becomes more popular, I will try to do something to annoy C3 fans, uh, but not today. First, we need to make C3 popular, so then we have somebody to annoy. Uh, right now, there is not that many people to annoy, unfortunately. How about hair? Uh, annoying hair developers, uh, I don't know. I don't think hair is that popular. Though, it's well known, but not that many people program in here. 